Education is a key factor when it comes to taking decisions, no matter how big or small they may be. I believe that there is great power in educating all people and giving them the tools to discover their full potential. Hi, my name is Mariana Lopez. I'm 14 years old and I'm here to highlight the importance of education in second and third world countries. I live in El Salvador, the smallest country in Central America, where as of today, a huge portion of our people are uneducated, some not even knowing how to read or write. According to a 2018 national census, 11% of our population falls into this category, with many more not even graduating high school. You may doubt when they say that education is the answer, so I use North and South Korea to demonstrate the difference made by education. As of today, North Korea is one of the poorest countries in the world, while South Korea is in the top and richest. The difference between them is their investment in education. After the Korean War, both countries were left in poverty. But on one hand, South Korea decided to invest in education, while North Korea decided to invest in military power. This is the case in many countries around the world. Countries like mine have huge potential, but are focused in other aspects instead of the root problem. We need to invest in education in order to progress. This is why I want to ask for your help, to raise awareness about the importance of education for everyone, the power that comes with knowledge and the beneficial impact that an educated population may bring. This is why you should choose me, because I want to raise awareness, especially in countries like mine, where many people don't consider education a priority, a threat not only to their futures, but their countries and the world. Personally, I'm someone who truly values all the opportunities I have had to receive such a good education, and I want others around me to fight for it too, to have the chance to receive a quality education and therefore a brighter future for all. Thank you.